Hey, what's up everybody? So what I just got done doing was when I bought the Deluxo, you got to hit your PlayStation button, go into your interaction menu, go over to your YouTube, go into YouTube. Once you go into YouTube, let it go in for a few minutes and then you want to hit your PlayStation button again and you want to come out of your YouTube video and then you want to go over to the, uh, when you come back to your interaction menu, the main one on the PlayStation. Once you come back to that, you want to go back over to GTA and log back in, and then you're gonna get a notification because you were something hey, something bad or whatever, and then uh, yeah, and then you'll be able to come in. So what did I just? Oh, that's right. I gotta do the bird thing. So here we are, continuation. So once you do the, once you buy the car, you do the step into YouTube and you know sign in and then exit back out and then come back into GTA and this is where you come now you're gonna do the bird part so now you're gonna get your bird that you have from story mode this is why you need to go to story mode and get the bird so you can do this part so now Oh, we're not that far away. So we're going to fly up, we're going to bring our interaction menu up, and you're going to have it on, you're going to hover over the quit director mode. You're going to leave it like that with the interaction up, and then you're going to fly your bird up, and you're going to look for a truck or a diesel or something like that, and you want to collide, but you want to do it good enough to where you get the notification where it says waste it. And everything and you get the notification for that once you get that you're good I'll try to show you what I'm talking about I'll try to get one quickly so we're gonna try right now here comes a car BAM can I get it nope so we're gonna repeat the process again until I get it this is the cool part that you get to do over and over again and it starts you right back to where you were and then you come and get your bird again get your bird and then uh, you wanna take flight bring your interaction up make sure you go quit director mode hover over that and now fly up and then just before impact of the truck maybe a few seconds just before impact you wanna hit the X button and start spamming it and then hopefully you get the notification hopefully you'll hear it because it'll come up you'll hear it after when it's downloading and stuff like that so if it's a close one sometimes you don't get it it could be a spot on one and you won't get it it's a trip all right here we go again Crap! Oh, did I get it no nope man So here in a couple of tries, if I don't hit it, I'll just end the video and that's basically how it would end if you don't, you know, get the bird or whatever. You would basically have to come back and try it again and stuff. So right now we're just uh, trying it out right now and seeing if we could get it again. I got it the first time. I've got it two times already. So this is my third one. So I'm trying to get it because I need my Deluxos in my garage my other character on GTA has like 15 of them already in the garage for a rainy day and then I, I, I have to sell one too as well because you know the more money the better but they're clean the plates are clean you don't need no custom plates you don't need no mods you don't need no save mode the cars are clean that you buy the deluxos they're clean the plates everything there's clean so you can't be duped detected you can't be none of that they're clean so it's it's a it's a money glitch this one here 
and this is the whole part about it. This is the tedious part is getting it right on on an accident. Whoa! Hit the ground. Doesn't really count, so we're going to try it again. Which is cool because it brings you right back to your bird and you can just get your bird and do it all over again. Alright, so now we're going to get up, bring that up again. So every time you take flight, you're going to have to bring your interaction up and go to quit director mode and just let it hover. And then you fly and look for a truck. Yes, either direction. It doesn't matter what direction. I'm just used to going this way. But if you get to the end and you want to turn around and come back, then you go down the opposite way. You know. A lot of cars. You could do it on a car. It's just it's it's tedious because the timing. It's got to be. Was that one? Yes. So that's what you want right there is that notification. Once you get that notification, this is the next step you're gonna do. So now the screen's gonna go black. You're gonna get the little white wheel on the bottom right corner. Once you get that, you want to hit for your interaction menu to come up so once it comes up you're going to push up once and then hit the X button this alerts going to come up if you did it right and then you want to hit OK So now you're going to come over back to your bird. You're going to scroll down to exit to story mode. Exit to story mode is where you're going to go. You're going to click on that. You're going to say yes. Hey, Mom. Now you're going to go here. You're going to hit the pause, the pause button. You're going to come over to online. Click on it. You're going to go down to play GTA online. Click on that. And then the button that's on, the first one says go, you're going to click on that. And then click this one and let it go. So now that's going to bring you to a, uh, your own little, so like, little lobby or public lobby. I think it'll bring back to a public lobby. So now you just got to double check and then when you come in, I'll show you what you do next when you get back into your facility. Sometimes it can take a while for it to load up again, but it's loading. It says right there in the bottom right corner, joining GTA Online. So it's doing its thing. Just let it process itself. Don't get too anxious. Be like, oh man, it's gonna quit. Not gonna do it. No, just wait. Just wait it out. Just wait it out, man. Just wait it out. In the meantime, we'll go smoke a fat blunt or something, and then give us something to eat, and then come back, and they'll start doing this part. See, here we come. Now it's going to bring me back to my facility. So now I should have a total of three deluxes inside my garage. So what I like to do is check my lobby. So they put me in the public. So now what I'm going to do is go online and I'm going to go to find new session and go to invite only. So now I'm going to let it process. So basically what I'm doing is going to an invite only lobby. You, the only way you can get in is if moi invite you to my lobby. Otherwise there's nobody in this lobby just little old me and that's how I like it. So now we're going to come over here. See, and then I'm going to show you again. So, 
my cash is back. I started out with four million seventy two hundred thousand two hundred and fifty thousand dollars left in the bank. I believe I said it right. I could be wrong. So we're gonna come over here. We're gonna look over there so it's not over there. So basically it's over here. It took a lead back here, so now we have three deluxos back here, which is great because I'm going to sell one in a little bit. I need some more money in the pocket pocket for the talkie talkie. So basically what you're going to do is just move these around and just move them from one spot to another. And that's all you got to do, and that's basically it saves them in the location they're in. So now you're good and secure because you moved them around. So now, you know, they're permanently saved in there. Nothing can happen to them. So remember, now you're in the invite-only lobby now. So you can start back up again. Or you could go into another invite lobby, either or. But that is the main process to the glitch. So I will restart it one more time for you guys. See, now, what's cool about it is that this Izzy here looks really, really cool, right? Okay, but the only problem with this is that it has a dirty plate, which means you get dupe, de de dupe detected by Rockstar, which means it screws up your sale, your uh, sales when you sell. Sometimes you might only get one day at a time to sell one. You don't want that. You want to be able to sell freely and how many other cars you want to sell. So I'm going to walk through it again and show you guys all once more how it's done to get this. So we are going to go into the internet, go to Warstock, go and scroll down. So now we're going to buy it. Gonna replace. 